Love Island fans have picked up on the fact contestants are refusing to use the incredibly refreshing villa swimming pool again on this year's series, and they're puzzled. The ITV2 series' major selling point is the idea of sun-soaked couples falling in love while living the Mediterranean dream on the island of Mallorca in Spain. And given the hopefuls constantly wander around in their bikinis and swimming shorts, it would make sense to see them splash around in the water once in a while. But this isn't the case, and Girls Laura Anderson, Megan Barton Hansen, Rosie Williams, Georgia Steele and Danny Dyer haven't been spotted taking a dip once. It's the same for male contestants Dr. Alex George, Eval, Ker, Jack Fincham, Josh Denzel and Adam Collard, who have merely gone as far as to sit on the edge of the pool. It turns out one of the major reasons for the pool absence is the temperature. While some people might imagine jumping in for a cool-off in the Spanish heat would be the first task on the agenda, the contestants are actually suffering from being at the villa at the wrong time of year. Revealing her experiences of the show in 2016, Katie McDermott explained that spring isn't actually warm enough to enjoy time in the water. The reality star said, Last year we didn't actually get in the pool a lot because it's so cold, because we went into the villa at the end of May and it's just about getting into summer. The pool hasn't been heated or anything, she added to OK. Online, aside from the disappointing temperature, one major turn-off could be previous contestants' extracurricular activities in the pool. After a triumphant win in last year's series, couple Kem, Seatony and Amber Davies confessed they'd ended up having sex in there on fellow housemate Camilla Thurlow's birthday. Speaking in an interview with the Daily Star after the series came to an end, the pair spoke candidly about their experience. While they couldn't keep their hands off each other, the couple were able to hide under a turtle float. It stands to reason that knowing this later contestants may be keen to steer clear of the area, despite the obvious cleaning sessions. Finally, the female contestants may be nervous about ruining their various beauty efforts by splashing about in the water. Sporting perfect hair dots and shimmering faked hands, many of the girls would inevitably end up looking rather different if they jumped in the pool. It is well known that swimming pools are filled with chlorine, which can not only turn hair a different color but also strip hair dye. The chemical can also have an unpredictable effect on fake tan, which could leave the women, who are known to use the product, with various streaks on their bodies. Love Island continues tonight at 9pm on ITV2.